But Wendy, we gotta find hope. Then I hereby rename you Little Flying Eagle. 
England, you can join our tribe.
Miss Bell, I know you and Pan are dear friends, so allow me to ask you the merest of favors. Please tell Peter that Captain Hook has admitted defeat, and tomorrow we'll leave never to return. Well, that's great, Captain. I will go tell the crew. Get back here, Smee! Yeah, it's all a squeaky, but no Pan has his faults. He brought that wedding to the island, after all. And rumor has she's already become between you and Peter. Then it is true. Oh, Smee, the way with the mad, the maid, taking the best use of her life and tossing her aside like a glove. <laughs> we must save Peter from Wendy, but how? We stay in the morning. That's it, we can shame hi, Wendy. Take her to sea with us. And then Pan will forget all about his delightful, ridiculous stories. Well, let Captain. We do not know where Wendy lives. <laughs> What's that? You can show to the lost boy secret hat out is. Take this down, Smee, and I promise not to lay a hand or hook on Peter. Let's go. They say fairies are either all good or all bad, but that's not true. It can be both. It's just that we're too small for two separate feelings to exist at once. And that day, I was really seen to Peter. I wish I could undo this, but it's part of the story. Yep, I did it. I told Hooker Peter Payne and Wendy were hiding.